this video solves the problem of the message uh, when you define something in ASP.NET Core. Uh, an unhandled exception occurred while processing the request. Invalid op uh, operation exception, the entity type of, in my case, this is content model here somewhere. Uh, where is it? Here, content model requires a primary key to be defined. If you intend to use keyless entity type called has no key in one model uh, creating for more information or keyless entity type C something else. So what you have to do in this case is you have to say simply by the model which you maybe sometimes when you get the scaffolding stuff from uh, from the ASP network then you have a terrible table so <coughs> I, dis I, re I rewrote the code there and you have to set a, a key attribute in there and then you a notation and then you will uh, have here the uh, error that you need here using system component model data annotations. So these annotations are straight in, uh, in your data model then. So this is uh, much better. And what is it this one now? Ah, it's not because it's still running, so I have to restart it now. And it's a lot better to write here your data annotations here in ASP when you are uh, when you have C sharp. It's a lot better. And the same one is the same one is now it's running. Yes, you see. Uh, the same is for other stuff like this. Uh, this is a better or better way how you may define it. You, you set this maximum length and uh, display format uh, straight up above your variable or your member from your uh, from your data class which you have or data model. So simply set it there. Here and uh, here, your length and all that stuff—it's uh, a lot better. 